Hi, I'm Gareth. And I'd like us to think a little bit about the way we describe our own abilities, both internally in our own heads to ourselves, but also externally to the outside world. I often come across students in classroom, in tutorials, on online forums even, who say things like, I just can't understand this. My brain can't cope. None of this is going in. I've had a brain freeze. And whilst I do understand that studying accountancy can be challenging, I think it's very, very dangerous to start a habit of putting down your own abilities. I had one student who handed me a mock exam told me they hadn't understood any of it and when I marked them off they'd scored over 80% so clearly they had understood some of it and yet they described themselves as not understanding any of it. Psychologists have a concept called labelling. Now the idea of labelling is if you give somebody a label, so say you call them a criminal or call them a sports person, that actually they will end up living up to that label. It's a form of stereotyping where the labels become a self-fulfilling prophecy and the self-identity of those individuals becomes more determined by the labels than actually by their own inherent abilities. So the person labelled as a criminal is more likely to accept that they're a criminal and therefore continue being a criminal. The individual labelled as a sports person is more likely to think that they're good at sports, to therefore train at sports and will become a better sports person. And I think even more important than how other people label us is how we label ourselves. The words we use to describe our own ability. Do we label ourselves as clever or as stupid? Do we label ourselves as being strong or as weak? Do we label ourselves as being capable or as being useless? And if you constantly criticise your own abilities, I think you can create a deeply entrenched negative view of what you're able to achieve. Subconsciously, you will convince yourself that you're not capable even if you actually are. So don't become your own limitation. Don't talk yourself out of the qualification you can achieve. Make sure the way you label yourself is going to have a positive effect rather than a negative effect. So instead of saying, I don't get any of this, say, I do get some of this. Instead of saying, my brain can't cope with this, say, my brain can't cope with any more knowledge today, but it will be able to tomorrow. Instead of saying, I can't understand this, say, I will understand this after a bit more work. And instead of saying, I've had a brain freeze, say, mmm, ice cream. <laughs>